my name is Harrison Mumia. I'm the president of the Atheist in Kenya Society. Uh, today we had a debate on the question of does God exist? Um, I was able to make the point that uh, God does not exist simply because uh, we do not have any evidence that there was a first cause, that there was a first beginning, that something that caused existence to begin. Um, I, I like the fact that um, uh, we were able to make the argument that morality has no uh, uh, reference. Uh, my opponents were making the argument that morality has a relationship uh, with God. I was able to, uh, I believe, persuade uh, the, the panelists that uh, morality is actually uh, as a very subjective concept. And I'm really happy that uh, the atheists in Kenya society, which represents over a million atheists in Kenya, had an opportunity to, uh, to, 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 to come into this debate. And I'm hoping that Kenyans uh, are going uh, to be skeptical, uh, to question the existence of God, uh, just like they question everything else. Because I think that is where we are as a country. We, 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 we live in a country where uh, we have different views. Uh, those who throw words at me online, I, I, I accept that uh, that is their right. My work is uh, to make sure that they are able to understand and be presented with the facts. So we are not afraid of Kenyans who uh, have a negative attitude towards atheists. We see that a lot online. We see people calling us devil worshippers. We are not devil worshippers. We are just people who have rejected the idea that God exists. So we welcome all sorts of criticism because that is the country we live in. That is a country that uh, we need to allow, that people are supposed to have different ideas. If you feel Mumia is not um, uh, talking your language, criticize Mumia, but also allow him to give you information as to why he does not believe in God. Uh, don't hate, don't hate, don't hate Mumia. Don't hate Mumia because he doesn't believe in God, because God is a human concept. So I, I expect that Kenyans are going to be more tolerant of the increasing number of atheists uh, in Kenya. Out of curiosity, are you Christian? Yes, my mom is a Christian. My mom prays for me every day. My mom hopes that one day I'm going to turn around and believe in God. Yeah, it has not happened. I'm not seeing it happening. <laughs> we are five. I'm the only one. Well, they like me because I'm a good human being. And I think what really is important is that uh, atheism does not mean that you're a bad person. Neither does Christianity or Islam mean that you're a good person. And that is the point that is very important, that you can be an atheist in a family, but a good person. You can be a Christian, but a bad person. So let us not judge in each other on who believes in God and who does not. It's okay for a family to have a person who is an atheist, but a good person who doesn't uh, commit crime, who doesn't do bad harm to others. And I think that is what humanism is all about, because I'm also a humanist. Mm -hmm. At what age did you uh, start to be a At the age of 22. Yeah, and you know, that was when I was in college, uh, when I was at the university, Jomo Kenyatta University of Agriculture and Technology. I realized that this idea of God does not make sense. I went into studies about atheism, about God, the history, historicity of Jesus, uh, the argument against uh, the existence of God. And through my reading, through my research, through my analysis, through my thinking, I realize God doesn't exist. God is just a creation of human beings. And I'm really happy that um, I've lived a very fruitful life and a very, very uh, uh, good life without God.